everyone so welcome back to another video on our channel and in this video i'm going to give you update regarding the tcs students so basically by tcs students i'm uh, talking about those students who have recently completed the tcs NQT exams and also given their interviews waiting for results okay so earlier uh, in my last video i've talked about those students who have been getting selection results and waiting for selection results but this video is going to be for those students who are not going to get selected this is about students who are rejected so if you have not received your uh, results yet this video is going to be for you and this is going to be regarding rejection updates uh, there were some doubts coming in my comment section that uh, about rejection how they can understand if they rejected or not if they are going to get a rejection update or not so let's see first of all uh, Till now, uh, we have seen some rejection updates. How and when we can understand these rejections, we are going to see first of all. So let's start without wasting any more time. But before moving on, if you are new to our channel, make sure to click on the subscribe button. Join our telegram and whatsapp channel from the description box link. And also make sure to click on the bell icon after subscribing. Because we post multiple hiring, onboarding and interview updates every day regularly. Make sure not to miss out. So uh, first of all, DCS have been sending results. By results, I am talking about the document verification mails and offer letters. Both are coming. For some people, the, at least only the document verification is coming. For others, both are coming. This is coming uh, phase-wise, region-wise. Again and again, I am saying this is not out for everyone. But for many regions, most of the people already got their results. So, depends on which region you are from. Okay. Suppose you are from region A. And in that region, majority of the people already got their selection results. And you still not got any update, not even any document submission, any mail, you did not get anything. Okay. And your interview is also done many days ago. Uh, but still, um, other people in your region getting results and selection updates, you are not getting anything. In that case, there is a high chance you are getting rejected. Okay. But suppose you are uh, in the same scenario but you are from region B and in region B very few students got results most of the people did not get any result and you also did not get any result. So there is a high chance you might get even selected or rejected anything can happen because for every region the results are not out yet again I am saying this uh, coming out region wise phase wise manner. So those regions who, where most of the results are out and if you still have not got any result in that region there is a high chance of rejection but in, if in your region uh, most of the candidates did not get any results yet so there is a 50-50 chance of getting selected or rejected. And some people are asking as well uh, will there going to be any uh, email or any uh, update in the next step portal. See that's completely depend on your HR and who took your interviews or who is in charge of you because other mails and everything are depending based on HRs. Uh, for selection mails also some people getting their roles mentioned in the document verification update. Some are not getting their roles they are just getting selected update. Okay. So similarly uh, for some people the rejections are getting announced via mail. For some they are not going to get the mails. Okay. But till now we have seen a uh, few candidates who got mails about rejections. Few candidates get to see the rejections via next step portal. But even if you are not going to get to see these things, I have told you in this video how you can understand if you are going to get selected or not. And even if you are going to get selected, rejected, whatever it is, I am going to talk to you one more thing. That do not just keep waiting and waiting for your results. Multiple other agencies also started their hiring. Recently, take mind the huge mass hiring have been announced. Have you all applied for it? You must have. Even if you are selected or rejected, it does not matter. You must have more than one offer letter in your hand. Okay. So go and apply. Click on the subscribe and click on the bell icon so that you do not miss out on any of these particular hiring videos we post regularly. Okay. Try to get as many offers as you can. So that's it. If you have any other queries regarding this, make sure to comment down.